Here's one of those white moths. They lay their eggs on the leaves and then they hatch into these little worms. When I start to see those worms is when I spray roughly every two weeks. The kale and the collards are the only vegetable I really need to spray in the garden. Sometimes I'll get insects on the tomato plants, but I think it's better not to spray these at all because I think any kind of spraying promotes blight so you're better off just leaving it as, it as it is. Here I've got my first sun sugar. I'm going to save this worm, put it in my garden bed, free worm castings. Check out this weed. Got pretty flowers. It's June 2nd and I start fertilizing the tomatoes and peppers with the more bloom. One tablespoon per gallon of the 511. and then two-thirds of a tablespoon per gallon of the 01010. Attaching these pieces of string to the tomato cage. Take the branches and weave them around the string. And I'll train the branches and they'll grow up. It's like an extended trellis. I bought one of these thermal cameras, plugs into a regular smartphone and it shows the temperatures. The plants are about 80 degrees. The deck boards are about 110 degrees. And it's just kind of neat to see the different temperatures. Good morning everybody, it's June 14th to do a quick garden update. The lettuce is ending its phase, starting to go to seed. My little Sunny Simpson plant, I'm gonna let flower and try to save seeds from this one lettuce plant. You can see the little flower buds starting. 
Check out the massive beetroots. And down here in the main garden, the pole beans are starting to be ready to harvest. Getting the first cucumbers. The corn plants are flowering, got the little silk tassels. And I've been harvesting some of the cherry tomatoes. These cupid plants are doing really good this year. Giant Marconi peppers. We got the California Wonder Bell peppers. Here's the sweet banana peppers. Starting to get a little orange tinge. They should turn, turn red pretty soon. Here's the plant on this side. Here's the front hex bed. Got the tomato plant vining up the strings. The basil plant. It's got the little flower tops. Here's cayenne pepper. It's got a bunch of green peppers on it. Sun sugar. Cherry tomato. Up here in the garage, plants are doing okay. Got one Roma plant. Had a bunch of yellowing, blighty leaves, and I trimmed those off. Not sure how good this plant's going to be doing, but the other ones are just filled with Roma tomatoes. Tomato soup. here in the back the groundhogs and the deer have pretty much munched up half of the garden they leave the pepper plants alone here's a bell pepper and the corn plants got a little tiny ear of corn growing and over here I've got some wild blackberries 